It's time for a moody sticker therapy. Stay tuned. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Planning Serenity, where we plan for serenity. My name is Jessica, and as mentioned, we are doing a sticker therapy, I guess based off my mood. So not a moody sticker therapy, but one based off of my mood. So if you are new here, here we go again with my books not being open. If you are new here, I appreciate you clicking on my video and stopping by. If you are returning, you already know how I feel about you. So if you are new here, I use the Hello Gorgeous Volume 3 Planner by Chris over at Luxbook. However, um, this template with the bottom black line comes from volume two. I also use digital sticker books where I house all of my digital stickers. Um, and I have several of them. So the ones that I use, I guess I'll, you know, explain it as I use them, but let's get started. So if you've been following me for a while, um, especially um, like on Instagram and YouTube, well, basically, if you've been following me on Instagram, you know that every day, um, since last year, I was posting, um, a photo of the YouTube spread. Does that make sense? A photo of the spread that I did with y'all on YouTube on Instagram. Um, so I have social anxiety. Y'all already know this. Um, and I get in spurts where it just becomes like team too much, <laughs> like, and not, not y'all, not y'all by any means, but like, like, I don't even know how to describe it. Like, I honestly can't describe it. So if you are new here, I'm also, let's get started because I, I always do this. So this is my Pinterest sticker book um, where I house all of my Pinterest digital stickers. Um, I do create my stickers. There's a video. Oh my gosh. Did I forget again, y'all? I forgot again, didn't I? I forgot to link the Pinterest video in the description down below. I told y'all I would keep it there and I still have not put it there, but Hopefully I remember after this video, um, the reason I forget is because y'all know I don't really edit my videos anymore. So I don't like watch it back to remember what I said, unless like, you know, an instance with the kids happen or, you know, something like that. And then I'll remember because when you're like looking at the video to like, you know, make sure it's, um, what am I trying to say? You know, to like add music or whatever, like background music, um, you can see spots in the thumbnails where there's like no hands on camera so that's really the only editing that I do now um is like editing like if I have to walk away from the video for any reason um so if I like tell y'all I'm gonna do something I sometimes for the most part don't remember because I don't really watch the videos back but I'm gonna try to do better I'm gonna try to do better um also, if you are new, I am a recovering alcoholic, so um, <laughs> the way my memory is set up, it's a lack thereof. <laughs> Let's just put it at that. All right, I am going to use, I have been wanting to use this for so long, y'all. This is from Pinterest, so I don't know if you noticed. I also, I did create the actual sticker of this, so you can see this one has no background on it. But as I was sitting here rambling, I was like, why not just use the one of the actual photo because it's taken kind of on a white background and I want to include that shadow in there that's not included when I remove the sticker. Good thing about digital stickers is you can reuse them. So um, I'll probably uh, reuse it with the actual sticker one day. But anyway, for now, we are going to blow her up and we're going to put her like on this side. Now, I know there's probably going to be a difference let's see with the um yeah you can already see it because of the shadow it's not exactly white so I think what we're gonna do I love giving y'all like little tips and tricks for things like this so although these sticker therapies don't get a ton of views I'm gonna keep doing them because honestly they are my therapy um and for those that watch them appreciate the little tips and tricks because they're not all about just putting photos on a spread. Now, <laughs> I'm trying to figure out exactly where I want this. Okay. And because we are using a white sticker, I'm just trying to put it on the line to where it doesn't overlap the black. Because y'all know I love my bottom black line. Okay, cute. Now, to fix this, I think what we're going to do is paste another one, but we're going to crop all the way to the edge right outside the phone that she's holding. So, hold on, I messed that up. Um, 
Um, so I guess I'll zoom, if you, I don't know if y'all can see, but the phone has like rays coming off of it. Hold on, I'll zoom in in a second. I'm just trying to crop right outside that phone so we get enough. Ooh. All right, let's see if we can work with that. Um, but as far as this, the lighting may be a little off because y'all know how it is when photos have like reflections, but I don't know if y'all can see. It's like her her natural hair, love it, is like blowing up. I don't know. It, I guess you could like her brain head explosion through her natural hair, which is so, y'all, this photo is so dope. It says a thousand words without saying any, like without any words on the picture. Anyway, what I wanted to show y'all is she's holding a phone. The cord to the phone is like frayed. Y'all, this picture says so much. Um, um, it's a cell phone, FYI. Um, but like the cord to plug it into the wall is like frayed. And then it has like these rays that it's like beaming into your eyes. Y'all, y'all. So <laughs> when I say I was like doing this as like a mood, like I didn't take a break from Instagram. Um, can I call it a break? But no, it's not a break because like, I feel like maybe every four or five days I post something, but um, it's just, it's a lot. And I'm not even just saying like my, my planning Instagram page, like my personal Instagram, I removed all of the photos from my personal Instagram page that I've had since like the beginning of time. Um, and I just haven't felt the need to like post any updated photos or anything. I don't know. I don't know. It's just, I don't know. And the crazy part is I look completely different. I look, I feel in my opinion, 10 times better from what I used to look like, especially since um, I am four years sober now. So, I mean, the skin is skinning, the beauty is beautying, like <laughs> um, the weight is perfection in my eyes. Um, Cause y'all know that's, that's a whole nother topic and I don't want to offend anyone, but I just, I, I like, it's, 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 yeah. So I look completely different. I have locks now um, that y'all, I've had locks for like, has it been a year and a half? Yeah, maybe like a year and a half now. And when I say best decision ever, best decision ever for my hair, like it is growing and growing and flowing and flowing. I don't know why I copied it. Oh yeah, because I had a white space. Um, all right, I'm getting so off topic. So let's we are gonna crop this, and I know I can get a black space, but but if you're returning, you already know, like, this is my, st oh, look how, y'all, I am going to have to use this separately from this sticker at all, like, oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. Okay, what we're gonna do, y'all know I have been loving the black strips lately. Honestly, I was gonna crop it a little yet, maybe like a little more. Um, Y'all know I have been loving the black strips lately, so we're going to do a black strip, but I want to have like the peekaboo of the blow up peekaboo, peekaboo of the blow up clouds. And let's just use the black strip to like cover up the connection that we made, even though the connection does not look terrible. Like you can only really see it like right here, like right, oopsies, like right here. I don't know. Here, let's zoom in. Maybe y'all can, Yeah. We zoom in you can see that screenshot connection right there um so that's like that's honestly not terrible but let's put the black strip over it because you know so aesthetic and it's just my obsession lately okay now we are gonna add some stickers that are not from pinterest so let's see <laughs> which is a shocker i know shocker okay Let's see. All right, we're done with Pinterest, so let's close that out. Main stickers. Um, these are by Digital Planner UA. Um, the stickers I use are always in the description, or the shops I use are always in the description when I use them. Um, let's actually paste this twice because I'm pretty sure. Let me see something. Where is that line? Yeah, I want to move it over on the right side of the the connection. Um. I swear when I'm planning like this way, like, like I said, y'all can look down and see what's going on planning this way. I'm like, this stuff looks so crooked, but the reason I'm, um, the reason I'm pasting it twice is because I want to be able to resize this without resizing this. Um, 
I want off, oopsies, I want offline to be a little large, but I don't want this to be as large, you know? And I want this to, okay, let's just do it. So you're like understanding what the heck I'm talking about. Okay, let's crop out offline and let's put offline like down here. Um, side note, this says offline is the new luxury, which obviously is mood. Now I'm not like completely offline, obviously, but hopefully y'all get it. Um, I kind of want it to be like shorter like this, a tad bit. All right, let's see. All right, let's stick it like right there. We'll obviously move it if need be. And then we'll crop is the new luxury out. Now, y'all know I love short and wide font stickers. So I want this one to be big and bold, but I want this to be short and wide and like dainty, <laughs> if it makes any sense. All right, offline is the new luxury. Do I want this taller? Yes, I do. Sorry, y'all. You know, when it comes to spacing, I get quiet over here. All right. And then I'm just trying to line this up, I think maybe directly under. Or I kind of want it closer to that big, bold black line, but I don't want this so far out, which would mean this would have to move over. And that's a lot of movement. Hold on. Let me see something. Ooh. Did that even move any? Let's see. Sorry, y'all. Like, I genuinely, like, am, like, speechless because I can't talk and get my oopsies. But y'all know, I was about to say by the time this hits Instagram, like I usually say, but the whole spread is the point of the fact that I haven't really... I think it's been, like, six days as of recording of this video. Um, this video is for... Thursday. Today is Wednesday. Um, so I'm getting a day ahead. Go me. All right. I don't know what it is. Maybe I want to move this down. Can this come over anymore? Honestly, this is too far down. Spacing y'all spacing. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to make her bigger so I can move it over. All right, but let's move this first. You just gotta do what you gotta do to get the result that you want. <laughs> All right, that's too far up. Oopsies, this is too far up. It's hard because I gotta look right here to see that it's on the black line, but I also gotta look up here to make sure that the black is against the edge, which I may do off camera because y'all will be sitting here all day. See, it's perfect there, but it's not there. Okay, we'll put it there. Now let's move the black line. Oh, we gotta move this first. Perfect. Much better, okay. Now I think we can work with this. All right, I feel like my head was in the camera. I've been focusing so hard. <laughs> so if y'all see a skipper in the video, um, it's because I was cropping my head out. <laughs> All right, I think that's better. Now, what I'm going to do is cut this, copy this again, because now I don't know how I want offline shaped. Crop. Yeah, I think I want to keep the original shape of offline and just make it larger. There we go. That's it. That's it. That's what I wanted. Okay. I know it probably sounds so crazy. I mean, like this whole process is like really just what in the flip nugget, but I swear it looks so much different and so much better to me. Okay. Okay. Cute. Let's actually make this a little, no, um, wider this way and then shorten it that way. Okay. Now let's go. Ooh, my tummy's growling. 
Um, this is my Lux Book sticker book where I house all of Lux Book stickers. Um, so all of these are by Lux Book, but as you can see, I use favorites because if I didn't use favorites, we would be here all day. So, um, we are going to grab this sticker that says the vision because totally is the vision offline is the new luxury and um if you're new to my channel my planning style is like moody editorial um slash minimalistic slash casual elegance let's shorten this um hence this spread that i'm doing which i'm absolutely in love with like this could totally be in a magazine And I don't usually hype myself up, but I'm really loving this one. Okay. Am I trying to line it up correctly? I guess I am. I mean, I can use the ruler, right? But I'm such a rebel. <laughs> All right. I don't think I can make it that short. Now again, when we're done, I'll probably stand up and then look down to see how the spacing is looking. And I know this is opposite way of this, but it's all a part of the aesthetic. I promise I want it that way. Okay, let's go back to, I want to put a sticker in that, oh, here it is. The deeper you dig, the darker it gets. How perfect is that for a flipping staying off the gosh darn social media? <laughs> I'm honestly just going to throw that down here. Do you see like the different font aesthetics and sizes and spacings and oh, I live for spreads like this. All right, let's go back to Lux book because I'm pretty sure I favorited an arrow that I've, yep. I've always wanted to use this arrow. I'm pretty sure this is the grind collection. I have, as you can see, all of her collections. So I don't remember the names of all of her collections. Typically one of the stickers, yeah, this is the grind collection. Um, If you didn't know, typically the, Lux book, one of like one or multiple of her stickers will have the title of the collection on it. Um, but yeah, this is the grind collection. Um, but I'm gonna grab the this sticker that says this, <laughs> this arrow that says this, and I'm gonna paste it right here. Now it looks like, let me zoom in so y'all can see it. I don't, I can't put, um, that's like, it's basically a watermark that was on this photo. Um, and obviously if I use the actual sticker I created, that watermark wouldn't be there, but we want that black background. And I actually think the watermark adds like a cool look to it along with like the moody editorial look. So we're going to keep it there, but I'm just going to use this, this sticker because I'm absolutely obsessed with it. Like this, you, you know, you know, y'all get it. All right. Do we want it there? Or do we want it larger? No, we don't want it larger. We want it nice and dainty like that. Y'all, I don't, I'm not gonna add anything like here. Like I said, I am a editorial minimal, minimal planner. So white space, everything. Black and white, everything. Love it. Y'all, this speaks volumes. I don't know if it's speaking to y'all. I hope it's speaking to y'all, but it's really speaking to me and I'm loving how this turned out. This is definitely a mood, a mood, a spread based off my mood. This has to be moved lower. Y'all probably can't see, but there's like a white, there's still white space down there that I need to um fix. But all in all, essentially, this is the spread and I'm absolutely loving it. So if you were new here and you made it to the end of the video, I genuinely appreciate you. <laughs> Please drop a black heart in the comments if you are new. And if you like what you're seeing, a like and subscribe would be absolutely awesome. If you are returning, please drop a drop our butterfly in the comments. Like this video as well. And I will see all of y'all beautiful, beautiful people in tomorrow's video.